hello everyone so today i have made a restaurant management system and firstly i would like to show how my code works and then i will show uh, the code section so let's run my code my project basically is divided into six panels and the working panels are just three panels this total receipt the button panel and the currency converter panel and this receipt and calculator panel why because the leaving panels are just the taking the inputs and showing us the output on clicking of these buttons uh, I'll show you how does it work suppose we enter the value for the chicken burger is 1 and for chicken burger meal is 2 and the cheeseburger are 3 let's select a drink here uh, and I want the quantity as 5 let's check box check the check boxes and when I click on total it gives us the specified amount of the drinks the milk and the delivery and here you can see the tax the subtotal and the total is also sh shown in the J label and here I have made a currency converter for the people who are not from our country suppose let's select the country as USA and we enter the bill value as 2100 here and let's convert it so in USA the worth of 2100 is $21 and let's just close this and the second button here is the receipt one it gives the receipt of the quantity which we have selected and we have a calculator also which works pretty well and here you can see it is in working condition and the third button is the reset button which clears the value from all the sections uh, I mean the input value and the output values the J label and the text boxes here so when I click reset there we go and the last button is exit so when I click on this the project shuts down so now I will show you how my code works so firstly I will go from the total button here and I will show you the source code so I have basically done here you can see this when I click on total these J labels get filled with the values so when we take the input value I just I have just set a variable here you can see I have just set a variable here yeah the burger mill I've set a burger mill for 300 so when we input a value it get multiplies with the 300 and results output in the label so likewise I have done this for all the total subtotal and uh, the cost of the de delivery tax and stuff and then I will go with this currency converter part so what we do here is I will show you the code first I will select here. yeah yeah we can see here I have set some values at the top that the currency these values are the values converted from an Indian rupees uh, I have selected the countries as Ethiopia USA and following countries so when we add some values they get multiplied with that values and the result is shown in the J label just like we have done in the previous section of the burger mills and etc and now the remaining reset button is just very simple we have to just set the values to null and we have to check the set the check boxes to false and the combo boxes as the first value we have set it that is select a drink and the choose one and the last button will go with exit which is pretty simple I guess all of us are known that yeah so now we are leaving with the last panel of our project that is the receipt and the calculator panel uh, the receipt panel I will show you the code for the receipt button here it's actually pretty simple that we are just getting the values from the chicken burger and the burger meal and the cheese burger and the quantity we are getting and just we are appending the quantity into our display and that's it with our project. Thank you very much for watching. This.